Well, I'm here with our Word on Fire team, as you can see, in Mexico City. We're standing right next to the great cathedral of Mexico City, and we're here in this wonderful uh, open square. And the presidential palace is over there, and we're surrounded by various historical buildings, government buildings. We just were in the cathedral saying some prayers and admiring its beautiful uh, architecture. We're in the center of what was the ancient Aztec capital. And in fact, the Templo Mayor, the, the, the great temple, was in this vicinity, and the Christians built their uh, cathedral on the site. Uh, with me is a good friend of mine, Father Eduardo Ortega. He's a native of Mexico and has spent a lot of time here. We've been friends for many years because he was a student of mine at Mundelein Seminary. Eduardo is here to help us a bit with our filming in Mexico. I wonder, uh, Padre Eduardo, if you could say a few things about this coming together of the cultures that we see here in Mexico City. Bob, as you said, is that this is a very interesting place and where two cultures meet, per se. We have the Templo Mayor and what we have, the cathedral. This is precisely what uh, is known in history the place where Tenochtitlan was established, was founded. That's the capital city. That's the it. capital city, yeah. and the Aztec would see this place as the center of the universe. So what we see now is uh, these buildings from the colonial time, and we can see the Templo Mayor, some of the, the parts of Templo Mayor, now in this modern society. is the, the coming together of two cultures, the mestizaje, as we know. You know, it's interesting when you mention the, the center of the world. So for the ancient Aztecs, the Templo Mayor was the sort of pole of the world. And that was the whole idea of the Jerusalem Temple. That was seen as the right. center around which everything turned. So of course, when the Christians came, they said, well, we're going to put our church, which is itself the center of the world. Every, right. every Catholic church where the Eucharist is celebrated is the point around which everything else revolves. So that archetypal religious idea of the pole of the world that's here very much, isn't it? We'll be exploring some of that in our time here, again, mostly at uh, the Basilica of Our Lady of Guadalupe, but also at the um, pyramids outside of Mexico City. So please follow us on the web, and we'll give you some updates as we go. And uh, please continue to pray for us as we produce this uh, world-spanning world series of, um, of Catholicism. God bless you.